Welcome, welcome, and welcome to another Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 scenery review. And I'm Pip, and one of the latest additions to the simulator marketplace is FS Dream Team's Charlotte Douglas International Airport scenery add-on, which we will do a quick flyby of today. Right now, what I'm doing is giving you an idea about what the stock default scenery is that comes with the game. And honestly, I am actually pretty impressed. The construction design and materials used looks close to real life, plus they have several hangars included and the parking garage that sits across the main terminal. Now keep in mind that I am being generous in my compliments because most of the terminals and surrounding structures in the game that are all stock all look the same and all have the same windows. Having the stock add-on scenery, I think this will give you a better idea of whether the FS Dream Team software is actually worth the $15.99 that it costs to buy the package. Before I forget, make sure that you like this video to let me know that it made a difference. So now that you've seen the stock package, let's see the difference with the add-on. The first thing you'll notice is the blue roofs on the concourses, which are very unique to Charlotte Douglas. In fact, take a look at this quick time-lapse clip from my plane spotting visit to CLT. You'll notice also the finished construction of the latest concourse A and parking garage which is part of a multi-billion dollar renovation that is going on at CLT through the concourses and terminals. For those who travel to CLT, I want you to pause right now and look to your right and see concourse E. The worst concourse in America. The main reason? Because regional air traffic can only get in and out one way, meaning it takes forever to taxi in and out. Anyways, that's a, a beef with the airlines, but back to the review. On the east side of the airport, there is a general aviation hangar and complex along with the North Carolina Air National Guard. In the middle of the landscape, you will see the ATC Tower, which FYI is one of the tallest in America. CLT is a major hub for the world's largest airline, American Airlines. As we move on, also I wanted to draw your attention to runway 18 right, 36 left in this general area. Next to the power box, there, there's a place where you can go to plane spot and is a popular place to be on a summer night. Take a look at this quick video. In my opinion, is the software worth the price? I'd go undecided, in part because I would have liked to have seen at least American static aircraft at the hangar of American, but overall, at $15.99, it is cheaper than other add-ons, so I guess you'll have to decide for yourself if it's worth it. But let me know what you thought of the video and make sure to subscribe, and if you want, you can catch my full plane spotting video of CLT right here. But for now, it's Pip signing off on another Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 scenery add-on review, upside down, sitting near Concourse A. Whoops!